Hi, this is Jason from Horrific Nightmares, and I got a package from my buddy Joe, the horror man, the other day, and unfortunately I can't act surprised because I did open it before I did this video because I was gone for the weekend. And I don't normally make videos over my daughters because we were watching our grand dogs for the weekend. So, I can't act surprised. What I can do is say that I am incredibly grateful and he sent me some really, really awesome stuff, which I'm going to show you guys. All right, let's start out with, because screw you, Netflix. Um, this is the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. This is a, because physical media I still feel is incredibly important. He did download this and it made me a copy off of Netflix for the newest Texas Chainsaw Massacre movie. Now, this is going to go inside my Black Maria. So, yeah. All right. The next thing he sent is the Star Wars Holiday Special. Now, this, of course, is going to be done for Positive Spin. And I can't wait to rewatch this. I haven't seen it since I was a little kid. And, um, yeah. <laughs> this is going to be a lot of fun. Okay, let's dig right into the box. Okay, he sent me one of my very favorite movies on VHS, which is The Little Girl Who Lived Down the Lane. Lives Down the Lane. Uh, this is one with Jodie Foster, and I've always loved this ever since I was a little kid. Uh, Martin Sheen is in it as well. And um, it's just a awesome, awesome movie. So, thank you, Joe. All right. He also sent me... The Exorcist 3. Now, we had reviewed this for, I do believe it was, yeah, Fangoria Movie Challenge. And I love this movie. It's just fantastic. And I'm so happy that he sent this to me. Because I love The Exorcist 3. I think I got rid of my DVD copy. But I do have the uh, Scream Factory Blu-ray. So, thank you, Joe. Alright, let's get right into this. He sent me After Earth. Now, After Earth is the much-hated M. Night Shyamalan movie. And I don't remember if I saw this one. I think I did. But this, of course, Positive Spin. Just like pretty much every single other um, movie that he did. Let's see. Another Positive Spin is going to be Christmas Vacation 2. Um... We were kind of trying to figure out whether to do this one, maybe, or uh, Christmas Story 2. Both are pretty much hated, but I think this might be hated a little bit more, so I think we might tackle this one. Can't wait to watch it. Cousin Eddie. Gotta love it. All right. Now, this is a grail item for me. Joe picked it up. I'd seen this a long time ago, and... Absolutely loved it. It's very hard to come across because it's very expensive. He actually found me a DVD of Boxing Helena. This is probably also going to show up for Positive Spin because this movie is absolutely hated. And this movie is one of those things that has to be seen to be believed. Those of you who have seen it, I'm sure, can understand. Um, fantastic movie. Julian Sands. Sherilyn Finn. Oof. All right. <clears throat> I remember my wife and I watching that back in the day. And it's kind of like a romantic movie. Up to a point. And I think that was the point that I that I finally uh, lost her on that one. All right. We have Jack and Jill. Uh, one of the... Probably most hated Adam Sandler movies, along with That's My Boy. Uh, this is going to be a positive spin as well, so look, be on the lookout for that. And the rest of these. Boy, where do I start? Okay. We're going to start with Something of Mine. Now, this is going to be one of the rare movies that I'm going to be reviewing for my 31 Days of Horror in October. And he also put as a... Uh, double feature, Teen Alien. Uh, something of mine is incredibly rare, and we're going to be talking about this. 
um, on a stream somewhere along the line. But yeah, I can't wait to watch this. I've, I've heard what it's about, and it sounds crazy. All right. Let's see. I'll leave that one. Uh, he made me a copy of Hard to Die. Now, he did feature this. I think he, he took a picture of his um, screener copy and his regular copy on Instagram. And this movie is fantastic. This is also known as uh, um, Sorority House Massacre 3? Something like that. But, yeah, Hard to Die I saw a long time ago, and I loved it. Fantastic movie. Fantastic. All right. <laughs> we have Chubbies. Here's the next one. Now, this is going to be for a stream that we're going to be doing somewhere along the line. It's going to be a creature feature uh, stream. So, small creatures. Chubbies. Always wanted to see this. And we have, in the same respect, uh, this is Beasties. They're horny little devils. Yeah, I'm all about that. Hell yeah. Can't wait to see that. Alright. Now for a grail item that Joe just um, posted on one of his uh, pickups. He sent me a copy of Mirage. Now he got the uh, VHS of this. And he sent me a copy of it so we can watch it together and enjoy it. This is one of the most... Um, one of the most rare slashers that isn't available here in the States. So, I can't wait to see this. Mirage. Looks cool. And the grand finale. <laughs> Ever since Joe did his uh, witchcraft um, review and ranking last year, I've wanted to see these films. So, Joe made me the ultimate collection. It is the witchcraft collection. As a matter of fact, one of the DVDs is in my DVD player right now. Joe and I are watching these, and this is all 16 of the Witchcraft movies. He was able to find them and make me a copy of them so we could watch them together and talk about them and rank them. We are about halfway through right now, and I am loving every minute of it. I think these movies are so much fun. They are so entertaining, and thank you so much, Joe. Um, yeah, <laughs> I just don't know what else to say. Um, Joe is the man. He's amazing, and... Um, I'm sure you're already subscribed to him, but if you're not, hit him up. He has made some amazing things for me, and um, thank you so much. And until next time, guys, peace.